Many South City residents say they are tired of the bumpy ride and obstacles left in the road by utility workers. Those holes are on many major roads and spread throughout neighborhoods. So who's really responsible and who's going to fix them? News Force Ashley Lincoln is on that story tonight, live in the Gate District near Jefferson and 44. And Ashley, that neighborhood has more than its share of the potholes. It's a lot out here, Steve, at least 10 on this street, and we counted at least four other streets that look the same way. Now, these exposed patches are about two inches deep. Now, drivers tell us that they take extra precaution out here when parking their cars because they don't know if they're going to step into this patch or not. And this is why they tell us they want something to be done quickly out here to make these streets smoother. Uh, we've been dealing with this probably for a good, shoot, two and a half months now. Are you driving in and out of holes? On Caroline Street in South City, you'll see plenty of uneven, rough, bumpy patches on the road. And then when you, you're walking, you got to remember that hole is there when you're stepping off the curb. News 4 found spires behind the patches after doing underground utility work. Drivers and residents alike are out of patience. You got to try to pull in the hole or out of the hole. I found the city of St. Louis is actually responsible for paving over the patches. According to the street department, they have an agreement with contractors like Spire. The city workers will come out and pay patches that are no greater than two inches deep after work is completed. The city tells me they do this to make sure they're paving over with the same materials. Right now, the city says they're trying to keep up with all of the projects currently being done by Spire. The city says Spire has at least 20 crews out working, digging anywhere from 40 to 60 holes a day. Operating with a staff that's short nearly 50 people, the city says they're trying to catch up with Spire. Going on month three, residents say they want something done soon. If this was the county or someplace else, these holes would have been filled up. Now, the city does tell me that they have at least 100 requests on file right now to come out here and pave up these patches on city streets. Now, they do tell us majority of their street workers are out doing paint jobs right now. So that's part of the reason why they have this backup. They do tell us they hope to come out to this area sometime this week to get these patches fixed up. Reporting live in South City, Ashley Lincoln, News 4.